In this lesson, we will add an indicator light to our web page. Let's import some images that we can use for our indicator light. Within the project window, underneath Web Page Editor, left click on the lamp folder to select it. Then, right click on the folder, which will bring up a menu. Select Symbol Factory. Choose an image that you want to use for the on indication of the indicator light. Now let's select an image for the off state for the indicator light. Right click on the lamp folder, select Symbol Factory, and then select an image that you want to use for the off state. In the components section, left click on the lamp object then left click and drag an area in the workspace to place the lamp. Click on the link box icon and select an address in the PLC that you want to associate to the indicator light. In the property window, left click in the value column beside image off. This will allow you to select an image for the off state. To set the on image, in the property window, left click in the value column beside where it says image on. We can add a label to the indicator light by using the border object. To do this, left click on the border object then left-click and drag an area in the workspace around your indicator light. In the Property window, double-click in the Value column beside where it says Title. This will allow you to enter a label for your border. Once you've entered the label, press the Enter key. To save our web page, click on the File menu and select Save Page. In our example, we used Internal Relay M500 in the PLC as the address associated with the indicator light. As this bit changes state, so will the indicator lamp on your web page. 